I'm standing in front of a Honor VL100A. This is a vertical lathe available from sale in the UK from Design and Technical Services. Honor is one of the world's leading vertical lathe manufacturers. The machines are manufactured in Taiwan and they supply thousands of machines a year into the global market. This machine here has a turret. This is for the turning operations. You can obviously turn the outside diameter, the inside diameter, and the machine itself is built using a box guideway construction on a heavy duty casting. Now the, the beauty of a vertical lathe is the fact that you can actually turn parts and the swarf falls away from the chuck. Therefore gravity is on your side. That compared to a horizontal lathe solution, for larger components it's certainly a more secure and a more practical method of turning. Now this machine has got plenty of space, you'd obviously load the machine using the, uh, the access at the top of the machine. You've got your coolant feed here to the left, so again for, for, for your turning operations you can make sure you've got plenty of flood coolant there. In terms of your extraction, you've got your swarf conveyor here to the right, so as the swarf falls away down the side of the, uh, the casting into the swarf conveyor and out the machine. A very large, by the looks of this, it's about 50 inches in diameter. So you've got a very large chuck capable of taking a lot of weight when you're looking at components. This particular part, I believe, is an Inconel, um, is an Inconel material. So whether you're machining duplexes, Inconels, stainless steels, that's where the Honor vertical lays really come into their own. On a control perspective, here we've got the Fanuc OI control. So again, you'd class as another benefit the fact that we are running a, a FANUC system, which the majority of, uh, of lathes, whether it be vertical or horizontal, use the FANUC system, therefore would be completely compatible with existing programs. So why would you go for a HONA? Well, heavy duty, high performance, difficult materials. The machines are also available with a, with a RAM style um, arm, so you can do milling as well. The RAM can actually... Uh, be used in conjunction with driven tools, so whether you're actually doing PCDs or milling in the side faces. So if those parts are big, they're difficult, they're heavy, and uh, you need a machine that's going to work day after day repeating accuracies, then you should consider the Honor VL100A.